Hey, welcome back to filthyfood.com. My name is Filthy Isaac and I'll be your mixologist today. Today I'm making for you a white gazpacho martini. It's gonna be a real fresh martini made with tomatoes, but it's gonna be white. So I took a little bit of cucumber, added that to the bottom of my mixing glass, and I'm gonna add to that just uh, one of our filthy pickles. The cucumber is gonna add a nice brightness to the cocktail. The filthy pickle will add a little bit of salt, a little salinity. It'll be a perfect balance. So I'm just gonna muddle these nice and good in the bottom of my mixing glass. You wanna release all the juices, bring the freshness of the cucumber, marry it with the salinity of the filthy pickle. Once you see the juice running, you know that your base is good to go and you can add your base spirit. Today I'm using one of my favorite spirits, tequila, and I'm using Malagro tequila. This is a really smooth tequila and has a real nice and peppery finish. It's gonna really balance well in the cocktail. So I'm gonna add about two ounces of that in here. That right in there. Next, I just fresh press some fresh lime juice. So it's just fresh lime, and I'm gonna add about half ounces to that. It's perfect. Now, that is gonna make uh, add a lot of acidity to the cocktail, so I'm gonna balance it out with just a touch of sweetness. I made a little simple syrup, which is just half sugar, half water. Made it uh, sugar, sugar water, and I'm gonna add a few drops of that. Next, I made a homemade tomato water. This is uh, our, our substitute for the Bloody Mary. This I made with uh, fresh tomatoes, a little bit of salt. I added some garlic and pepper, and then I pureed it just lightly, and then I put it in some cheesecloth and let it sit in my fridge for two days, and then strain it into a metal bowl, and that's the end result. Nice and clear. Um, that way we'll be able to see through the final cocktail. I'm gonna add a little bit of ice in here. I'm gonna give this a nice vigorous shake. I'm gonna, I wanna put all these flavors and bring them all together. Shake it nice and good. And once you feel the tin start to frost over and gets nice and cold, you know your cocktail is pretty much ready to go. Dump out my ice here. My martini glass is real nice and cold. And I'm gonna strain this martini right in here. If you look at the color, way different than your normal tomato-based cocktail. It's nice and white. You can see the cucumber. It just looks fresh. Now I cut up a little bit of a tomato and I got a, a real fine dice on it, almost a confetti style, and I'm just gonna drop a few pieces in there for color. And I did the same chop with uh, some cucumber. Real nice and small. And that, as you're drinking it, you'll get a nice little bit of texture in it and a nice mouthfeel. Then I'm gonna put a little bit of white peppercorn, uh, pink peppercorn, excuse me. Pink peppercorn's nice and sweet and also has a really nice color in the martini glass. Last but not least, I'm gonna add my filthy pickle, delicious, and that will extend the total cocktail. And there you have your white gazpacho martini. My name is Filthy Isaac. You saw that here on Filthy Food. I'll see you next time.